here to Dangi in Taita for PA quest. So we arrived here at around midday. We were chosen, we were divided into three groups. And the navigators were chosen to help allocate the quest. So we had three quests. The first one was from where we, we arrived at Nguraro to Kungu, which was approximately three kilometers. Then we headed from Kungu to Wesu, which was around two kilometers. Now we are back at the school. We've pinched our tents and we're going to make dinner. We started our journey at around 9 where we began our walk towards our West, our West Sioux Hospital site. So we continued there until we made a pass through different kinds of checkpoints, taking short breaks along the way for the navigators to figure out the next spot. Once we made it to uh, what I'd like to consider like the checkpoint before the beginning of the actual journey, which was St. Jones, um, yeah, we reached there, we took a short break, and then we began our journey up the hill. It was long and tiresome and we managed to cover 18.5 kilometers. We are here at exactly 7 to make for ourselves dinner and go to sleep. to remove our tents because we're not at our own school or at a campsite where we can stay longer because the children had so many kids. So we started closing up our tents, getting ready, changing our clothes, and then made breakfast. Breakfast, uh, we made some, some teams made eggs, tea, with bread, and then we started cleaning up and getting ready to go to the bus. So we put all our stuff in the bus and then headed here to the foggy field where we played football and other fun games that involved running because our legs can still handle it and it's kind of cold and drizzly but it's nice it's a nice weather compared to Mendoza. Yeah. so our plan after this is to go for a two hour hike one hour to move fast and then get ready to come back home. So that